So today we're going to talk about the game key, uh, gamepad keyboard for DOSBox Turbo 1.50. So here it is on the Play Store. It's a free download and the setup is a little bit different with DOSBox Turbo 1.50. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So it is installed. Let's go back to our home screen. And to enable it, you need to go into your Android settings. We're going to scroll down to language and keyboard. And then we're going to turn on the gamepad keyboard. And that's it. It's enabled. Now we can fire up DOSBox Turbo. And once it loads up, I'm going to show you uh, the gamepad keyboard. First, let's change the input method and select gamepad. And now let's bring up the keyboard. As you can see, the gamepad keyboard defaults in keyboard mode. It's got two different modes, keyboard mode and gamepad mode. You can access either mode by swiping left or right to change modes. So we'll go ahead and do that. And as you can see here, it's got a, a virtual D-pad as well as four buttons. What I want to do is I want to map these buttons so that I can play some DOS games. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go into the DOSBox Turbo configuration screen. As you can see, I'm running version 1.50. Uh, and let's edit the button and controller maps. Now by default, DOSBox Turbo already sets up the up, down, left, and right D-pad mappings to the um, arrow keys on the keyboard. So I want to map the X and Y buttons so I can play Doom. So let's go ahead and do that. So I hit, hit Add Button Mapping and I have a, a custom button mapping here that I'm going to define. Now the cool thing about DOSBox Turbo 1.5 is you can define arbitrary button mappings. Right now, if I wanted to, I could assign uh, any hardware key to any DOS key map. For example, if I want to map my search key, I would hit search and you can see up there the key code search button, uh, the hardware key code search um, appears. Now, today I'm going to talk about the virtual gamepad keyboard. So in order to bring up the gamepad keyboard to do mappings, I have to hit this edit text box. And I'm going to hit the Y button because I want to map that first. So I hit Y and you can see the key code changes. And let's map that to the enter key. And hit OK. And as you can see there, we've got the key code button Y mapped to enter. Let's add another button mapping and bring up the gamepad keyboard. Let's map X this time and let's map that one to the left control. Hit OK. So now I've got my X and Y buttons mapped. I've got my up, down, left, and right mapped to the default uh, arrow keys. Let's go back to DOSBox Turbo, bring up the keyboard, and start Doom and see what happens. Let's start a new game. And let's see what happens. As you can see, it's working pretty good. And that's it.